Hey, it's Scott again. We are still looking at the very cool new features in Photoshop CC 25, 2015.5. I'll never get used to saying that. Okay, let's take a look at this thing because this is really cool. It's a new, whole new world of Liquify. Let's take a look at our picture here. This is John. John's kind of grumpy. We're going to fix that. We're going to go to Liquify under the filter menu. Liquify. Standard or Liquify? I think not. This is Mega Liquify. Check this out. When it opens up the window, you now have this thing called Face Aware Liquify. Now, it says select face, and you're like, well, there's like, you know, just one face. But if there were a group of people here, if there were more than one person in the shot, you could say I, which face you want to work on. Now, what's cool about this is you don't have to make a bunch of selections and stuff. It is doing facial recognition. It sees that, that where he is and everything. That's what these little lines telling you. Yeah, he's right here. We know there's his eyes, there's his nose, there's his mouth. They put these points in. All you have to do is move sliders. So for example, let's go to his mouth because he looks a little unhappy, right? So let's go to his mouth. There's a, a smile slider. Watch, I can just, Come on, John. It's not so bad. There we go. Just a little bit of a smile. Thanks. You can move his upper lip. If you want him to have a sneer, right? I don't think we really want him to have a sneer. We're trying to make him happier, right? Um, then we've got uh, the lower lip, right? You can make him talk. Hey, what's up? Where? All right. Then you've got the width of his mouth, right? You can do the, the height of his mouth for more talking. Hey. What are you doing? Okay, so there's, there's really, this is, this is, my daughter's just going to love this. Anyway, um, you can do all kinds of things in here. Now, he's got a very nicely shaped nose, which of course makes me angry. So I'm going to make his nose wider. You can make it thinner or wider. Uh, his nose height. So you, I mean, it's just, it's amazing the controls that are here. You can do his eye size. And I don't know why you'd want to make his eyes bigger, but I guess you could if you wanted to. You can do the height, the width of his eyes. There's all kinds of things that you can control. And the tilt, the eye distance and all. So look at the distance between his eyes. I mean, it's just ready to go. Um, face shape. So you can control his forehead, right? You can control his chin height, right? And let's tuck that in a little bit. His jawline, look at that. And then even the width of his face. So just incredible. Now, all the Liquify stuff still works. You can still use all the tools, the Liquify brush and all that kind of stuff, but I'm gonna go ahead and just click OK. And you can see the changes I made in just a couple. John looks so much happier with a little bit of a smile, doesn't he? Anyway, I'm just kind of touching the surface, but just wow. Now, if you're going, this kind of looks familiar. They took the technology that they originally developed for the app Photoshop Fix, and now they've put it in Big Photoshop. You know what I saw? What I, well, The first thing I said when I saw Photoshop Fix for the first time? Why isn't this in Photoshop? Hey, guess what? Now it is.